Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Jennifer and today I'll be showing you the outline stitch. Okay, so I'm just taking a random scrap of felt. I'm working with black today. And I grabbed two strands of pink um, just to show you guys as best as possible uh, close up. So this is the outline stitch. We're going to start from the bottom and we're going to come up. And I'm just doing this freehanded because, you know, because I can. And make sure that your your uh, floss is up here, okay? When we're doing the outline stitch, the floss needs to be up. And starting it is a little tricky. So you come up from the bottom. And we're just going to try to do a straight line here, okay? I'm going to... Um, I don't go all the way through to the bottom. I try to just pick up just the top parts of the felt. I work with felt a lot. So, so I'm going to place it right about here. So the tip of my needle is going to is going to come to where I came up, okay? And I'm not going to go through the bottom. So we're going to go straight, okay? We're not really it's kind of a little bit of an angle, but I'm trying to actually go straight, okay? I'm going to go I'm going to pull it and that's our beginning, okay? Notice that this is sort of in the middle of this straight line. Okay? We're going to keep doing that, okay? And again, make sure your th your thread is up up here. And we're going to go again, and we're going to go about halfway, okay? So we're going about right about here. So we're kind of creating like little straight lines that stack on top of each other. Okay, and the tip of my needle is coming where I, where this one ends, all right? Okay, we're going to pull. There we go. There we go. Okay, now we're cooking. So the the end string should meet up somewhere in the middle of the of the line that we're creating. Okay, and we're gonna do a few more times. So I'm just kind of doing this by eye. And I'm trying to do a straight line here. See how my needle comes up where the other one this this one ends. There we go. See how they're kind of overlapping each other? That's the outline stitch. Okay, a few more. And I'm trying to go slow for you. Normally I can do this really quick, but because I'm showing you guys, I want to go slow. Okay, and you know, when you're doing this for the first time, it's not going to be perfect, I'm telling you now. It takes practice to do a really nice outline stitch. So take your time, like I am now, make sure that you have it where you want it. And it's all about spacing. There we go. And do you see how they're overlapping each other? I'll do a few more. And this stitch you can pretty much do on any type of curve. So you can do this stitch on a curve too. You just make sure that your stitches are smaller when you're going around. But right now I'm just showing you the straight, going in a straight line. So that is the outline stitch. And when you're done, so I'll say, okay, I'm done with this. This is all I need. So then instead of coming back up, you just kind of guesstimate where it is and then just go back down. There you go. And then you tie it off. And that is the outline stitch. Alright, if you have any questions, leave the comments down below. If you like this video, please uh, hit that like button and the subscribe button if you haven't subscribed yet. If you want to see more of these little tutorials, please let me know and I'll be happy to do them for you. Um, thank you for watching and I'll see you guys in my next tutorial. Bye!